at a continuous reverse push action. And really what we're focusing on is having repeatable footwork. What I want you to understand is if you can repeat the footwork that you're using, now you know that your technique is actually getting strong. Anybody can do one set of footwork and just be done with it. But if you can put it on repeat, literally do it six to 10 times in a row, now you know exactly where your technique is. Now right now, using the footwork mat in the cone, I have all the accountability I need for my space. So if I perform my drop, the cone stays underneath my hips. I haven't drifted forward, left, or right. And now that I can drive, I have my hand exchange speed stop behind, and I want to then get right into my reverse push. So as I reverse push back, I land right back into a drop stance, now obviously ready to go the other way. Now, in slow, it looks awkward, and fast, you have this amazing ability to drive forward and immediately come back into your original space, which creates natural space, of course, and natural closeouts. But what I want you to focus on, in order to not always necessarily bring the ball to our pocket, is actually doing a turn pound right as you're landing, so you're already ready to go again, and you alleviate the risk of an actual carry call, as obviously the ball's in your hand for long periods of time. So I have my turn pound on that landing, I get right back into my hand exchange speed stop behind, and then of course you repeat that again, where you can repeat that action repeatably. So all you're gonna be focused on right now is see if you can get this six to 10 times in a row at full speed. This is a leg burner. You have 20 minutes to really focus on this. And so feel free to take your time in between, take some rests and see how well you can perform it. But I really want you to focus on how well you can control that space and, and while doing so, control the inside step repeatably. As I said, any footwork that you can repeat is technique that you own. Keep that in mind as you work on your continuous reverse pushes.